So here's a quick overview of the WP Auto Content plugin. So we start here with a completely brand new WordPress site. You can see I click on the home page, there are no posts here. I have just created three categories, but there are no posts here, so it's all empty. So we we'll go here to the admin site and go to the auto content here, and we're going to create a few content campaigns. All right? We're going to create a, a site about photography. So first campaign is going to be, for example, photography books. It's going to import four posts per day, and they're going to go to photography books. And we're going to add text books, photo books. All right, so let's add some extra uh, content sources here. For example, we want to add some Amazon books about um, photography, photography books in category books. And we're going to add a buy button so we can get a fit commissions if we make a sale. Right, and we're going to add also books from, let's say, eBay here. And we're going to Again, the learn photography, for example, category in books here, and again, a buy button so we can make some money if we purchase. Right, so let's save this, and we've got a campaign here. Let's go again to, we're going to create another campaign here. All right, and the one about photography tips. Photography tips, we're going to call this campaign, we're going to import six posts per day, and it's going to be photography tips and then photography for example we're going to add the tags here so we can also add uh, extra images if we want if the content doesn't find any images for example photography here and again we're going to add some content sources here all right so as you can see we can add content sources for a lot of sources they could be like uh, article directories videos e-commerce uh, other sites, news, social, etc. Right. So, for example, for this, we're going to add some uh, YouTube videos here. Uh, we can add by keyword channel trend, so we could import all videos from a specific channel. In this case, we want to learn photography. We want to fetch a video description, uh, remove links, load, and update the text. We can also spin text if we want to make this unique. And we're going to add more something else here since this is. Uh, tips, uh, we're going to add some Udemy courses here. Uh, we're going to add the photography, this is the keyword. Again, we can spin the content, we can add a link to the original source, and we'll save changes. Uh, let's add a third campaign here, right? This one is going to be a photo the cameras here. Say four posts per day, and it's going to go to photo cameras, wiki camera, photo camera. And we're going to get content from, let's say, Amazon products. Let's write here photo camera and their camera photo. And we're going to spin the content. Let's go to add my button. And let's add more content here from, let's say, Best Buy. Okay. Um, again, get the camera, add the button, and purchase on no, sorry, Best Buy. All right, so let's save this. Again, you can add multiple content sources per campaign. So what this is going to do is going to add new posts every day Again, you can see this. There are no posts at this point, so we're going to it's going to run every day, but we can force it to run. So oh, let's run this campaign here, and it's going to import photography books from Amazon and eBay, right? So here it is. So it's imported two from Amazon, two from eBay. Let's run this campaign as well. Photography tips. There's going to be YouTube videos and Udemy courses here. That's going to import. You can see three from YouTube, three from Udemy. And finally, let's import let's run this campaign. So again, this campaign is going to run on autopilot every day, importing the number of uh, posts that you set. Right. So let's see what our site looks like right now. Let's open this. So we went from a completely blank new site to a site with a few content here. Right. We got cameras here, and if we click on it, for example. Uh, you have a if you purchase Best Buy, you get a link. If the customer buys from here, you get an affiliate commission. 
Same thing with books here. If the customer uh, reads this and decides to purchase here, you can purchase from eBay. And if they purchase, you get a commission here. And again, from Learn Photography, we got a few videos. Uh, this is the uh, Udemy courses or this uh, YouTube videos here as well. You get the YouTube video, you get the content, you get the tags on autopilot, etc. And let, let me show you that's the front end. Again, you can spin the content to make it unique. You can import from multiple sources and you can check if you go here to the log, you can see what's happening in the background. All right. You can see we've imported all these posts. This is from the source from Amazon, Udemy, YouTube, eBay, Amazon again, spotted 14 today in total. You can filter if you want to check by campaign. You can create unlimited campaigns. You can use different sources here for the content. And let me show you something very cool as well. We offer this an, as an OTO, but you can also get, um, you can monetize and get traffic on autopilot. All right, so first OTO, it's a monetize here. Let's add uh, this is going to be tips. Let's go to add, you can add anything, banner ads, you can do AdSense ads, Gmail, different kinds of affiliate ads on autopilot or different links or other stuff. For example, we want to add some, let's say Clickbank ads about photography, all right? It's going to be keywords only for photography. And to display the price, three ads, three per row. Um, like this, and this is going to be at the beginning of the post, all right? And we're going to add one more here, which is going to be an opt-in form here, an opt-in form. We're going to add this at the end of the, um, okay, photography tips. Right, we get different styles here, we're going to add this at the end of the post, and we're going to save changes here. So let's see if we get uh, campaign photography tips. We're going to check this here, photography. So let's, let's see what happened here. So these are all ClickBank products, um, autopilot related to photography. If the user clicks here and buys and is buying, you get a commission from the sale here. This is the photography. Again, this is all the content that's important. At the end, we added, remember we added some an email opt-in here, so you can capture leads here, autopilot. And finally, let me show you the traffic uh, method. So you get traffic on autopilot. So every time, every time there, there's a new content published, if you can add a traffic system, you can get links on autopilot, you can get a new post index uh, immediately, or you can share on social uh, websites, so you get extra traffic, all right? For example, if you select Facebook, you could share it to the Facebook page, that you own, or you can tweet it, uh, you can uh, publish in Reddit, Pinterest, Instagram, or different sources here, that's going to get you traffic on autopilot. So you get, let's recap here, you get different uh, content here, then you get, you can get uh, monetized on autopilot, and finally, you can also get as another OTO that your customers will love. You can get traffic on autopilot and then you get everything under the log here. You can see what's happening here and just set and forget and then make some nice commissions. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Bye.